We're in Acts chapter 1. We were in this passage last week, but I want to continue and draw out some additional thoughts from this important passage. It is so important because these are the, this is what happened just before Jesus ascended and went back to heaven to sit at the right hand of God the Father. And uh, it says in Acts chapter 1, verse 3, it says, to, the, to whom, to the apostles that he had chosen, Jesus presented himself alive after his suffering on the cross by many infallible proofs, being seen by them, his chosen apostles, during 40 days, and speaking of the things pertaining to the kingdom of God. And being assembled together with them, he commanded them not to depart from Jerusalem, but to wait for the promise of the Father, which he said, you have heard from me. For John truly baptized with water, but you shall be baptized with the Holy Spirit not many days from now. Therefore, when they had come together, they asked him, saying, Lord, will you at this time restore the kingdom to Israel? And he said to them, it's not for you to know times or seasons which the Father has put in his own authority. But you shall receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you shall be witnesses to me in Jerusalem and in all Judea and Samaria and to the end of the earth. Now when he had spoken these things, while they watched, he was taken up, and a cloud received him out of their sight. And while they looked steadfastly toward heaven, as he went up, behold, two men, it says, stood by them in white apparel, who also said, Men of Galilee, why do you stand gazing up into heaven? This same Jesus, this Jesus who was taken up from you into heaven will so come in like manner as you saw him go into heaven. 